the arrest of Pakistan's former president, Pervez Musharraf. Earlier, Musharraf appeared in court following an arrest order issued against him on Thursday. He's now being detained at his farmhouse outside the capital, Islamabad. Musharraf turned up at a court in the capital Islamabad to accept the arrest order issued on Thursday. Musharraf is wanted for illegally dismissing several judges, among other charges. Musharraf resigned as president in 2008 and lived in self-imposed exile. He returned to Pakistan last month. He set up a new political party to contest the country's parliamentary election on May the 11th. But election officials blocked his attempt to file candidacy for the election. They cited his alleged authoritarian acts while in office. Now the court orders have been executed and if he's arrested, uh, he's in no position. But I think the writing was on the wall when his nomination papers had been rejected. He should have seen the writing on the wall and should have moved out. Now with this sort of a scenario, he really doesn't know because now it all depends on General Kayani and the army as to how do they deal with it. The former general has been placed under house arrest for two days. Musharraf's legal team has said they will challenge the arrest order in the Supreme Court on Friday. If Musharraf is sent to prison, it will be the first time an army chief, retired or otherwise, has been put behind bars in Pakistan's 65-year history. Well, actually, we're at the BBC Bureau in Islamabad at the moment, and there is uh, confusion and, and disputed accounts about whether or not he was actually arrested. Police are saying uh, that they placed him under arrest overnight. Uh, an aide for Parvers Musharraf is saying no. In fact, he surrendered to the authorities. Uh, either way, he was presented in court this morning for the second day in a row. Uh, you'll remember, of course, yesterday that he made a hasty getaway from the High Court, uh, surrounded by his bodyguards, after Judge Judges revoked his bail and issued an arrest order. Now, this morning, judges decided that he would be spared a trip to jail, at least for now. Uh, he has been given two days of house arrest, so he returned to his luxury fortified villa uh, on the outskirts of Islamabad, but his legal problems are far from over. Now, we know his lawyers intend to uh, go to court today to try to challenge the arrest order, so we expect uh, a lot more legal maneuvering through the day. But for now, uh, the former Pakistani president, the former army chief and military ruler, uh, is under house arrest at his villa.